Hey, what is up internet? Kyle here, Slapshot Toys, doing another soccer vlog today, but today's gonna be a little bit different because it is not FC Cincinnati. Yes, we are in Cincinnati, it is raining, which means it is a match day, but uh, today is actually a warm-up for the U.S. men's national team. They are playing Venezuela here at Nippert Stadium. So, yeah, thought we'd come down to the match. Uh, check it out. We are headed to Top Cats now because, so, much like the Pride, there is the American Outlaws, which is uh, the supporters group for the U.S. teams, the men's and women's, which I am a part of. Then we do have a Cincinnati chapter. So we're all meeting at Top Cats like we do for actual FC Cincinnati games. We're gonna pick up our new scarf for this year and we're gonna go to the match. So I'll show you a little bit of everything. So let's go to Top Cats. <laughs> Two things better than dreaming. 
watching one come true, and others are saying you had a hand in it too. Like the iconic poster, I'm pointing the finger and saying, I want you. Pioneering a path of prosperity won't be perfect. It's in the process where we must place our trust. That means that the future is now. And the future is us. How we do it, Cincinnati! So that was all my footage from the U.S. Men's National Game versus Venezuela, and this is actually July 4th. So this is an extremely long time since I actually took all the footage, and yeah, just life has been absolutely crazy. Got a promotion at work, just some other stuff going on that just has taken up all my time, so I haven't really had any time to do any sort of toy vlogging, soccer vlogging, anything. Uh, but things are starting to come down just a little bit now, and I figured with it being July 4th, 
what better time to put together this little video vlog of the USA match. And not only that, but you know, you have the men's national team now starting to play really well and just beat Jamaica last night. Then you have the Unreal women's team making their third straight World Cup final, and they honestly should win their second straight World Cup. So just a lot of stuff going on to be excited about, so that's the reason I went ahead and just decided to drop this video now. And honestly, the match that we saw wasn't the greatest. Uh, Venezuela really kind of took it to the U.S. The U.S. looked out of sync. And yeah, I mean, it was a cool experience to be able to say I've seen the U.S. men's national team, uh, that they were in Cincinnati. That was amazing. Uh, the crowd was awesome. There were so many amazing Venezuelan fans. Uh, that was one thing that really impressed me is how well they traveled. They came from all over. There was a group that was saying that they were from Indy, and they came over to Cincinnati to watch Venezuela play. And it was really kind of cool just to see like the support that these national teams get, not just the U.S. And, and all across the world, these fans come and actually watch their teams, and that was just really so cool to see. Um, so yeah, that was an awesome experience. USA played in Cincinnati. The women's team played a couple years ago. Men's now uh, played this year, which is just so cool that we are starting to get teams like that. And yeah, just a really, really cool experience. Hope you guys enjoyed the footage. SC Cincinnati, kind of on a sour note right now. I'm going to remain extremely, probably annoyingly positive uh, throughout this whole season because this is my team, this is my squad. I know we're gonna turn it around. Uh, it's just a matter of rebuilding, getting the right pieces into place. And you know what? I bleed blue and orange when I say I'm Cincy till I die in the chance. I actually mean it, and no matter what, I'm going to support this club, and yeah, going to try to find a silver lining, even in a 7-1 loss versus Minnesota, and that one stung a little bit, that one was really kind of hard, but you know, you just got to laugh at yourself at some point. But uh, yeah, a lot of cool stuff going on in the soccer world. Uh, like I said, it is July 4th, so I hope everyone out there has a wonderful and safe July 4th holiday. Um, for those of you who are in the U.S., for the other parts of the world, if you guys are watching this, you guys probably don't care at all. But uh, if you're in the U.S., uh, happy July 4th. I uh, hope you guys have a fantastic day. And let's go U.S. in the World Cup and Gold Cup on Sunday. So I think that is going to do it for me today. Thank you guys so much for checking out these videos, and I'll catch you guys later. See ya!